Hi, today's verse comes from Colossians chapter 1, verse 13 and 14. He has delivered us from the power of darkness and conveyed us into the kingdom of the Son of His love. Let's just pause there on that 13th verse. Look, we know that the supernatural supersedes the natural always, and the natural never supersedes the supernatural. However, when we look at the supernatural realm, we have God, the kingdom of God, the Trinity of God, the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. And then you also have the devil who also has some limited supernatural power. We know that he is limited because he's not everywhere at the same time. He's not all-knowing. And we know that his days are coming to an end. We know that God has angels in heaven that as we pray as his sons and daughters, angels come down to fight the darkness, the powers of darkness, the principalities of, we know, the powers of hell. And as we pray, we know that the angels fight against this darkness, that no weapon formed against us will prosper because we know that the angels of God are on our side. And as the angels of God are on our side, as we faithfully pray, live for God, and read the word, and claim his promises, we also know that God constructs in us a brand new creation, day by day, under construction, that God does his work in Nick Voyages day by day. To be a better person, to be a better husband, to be a better father, and a servant of the King of Kings and Lord of Lords. We know that the kingdom of Jesus and his love is continually uh, being built up in each and every one of us as we serve God with all our heart. Verse 14 says, In whom, which is the son of his love, in whom we have redemption through his blood, the forgiveness of sins. And this part of this verse for me, or verses, reminds me that no matter what happens on the outside, No matter what discouragement may come that I may see, feel, or know about, we can always come back to the hope that we have in Jesus, which is I'm forgiven because Jesus died for me. I'm not dying. I am living forever, even when my body is buried in the grave because of his blood, because of the forgiveness of sins. We know it's the power of of the Holy Spirit that raised Jesus Christ from the dead, and that Holy Spirit, God, lives in me. That's the hope that I have, that no matter how old I get, no matter what pain I have, that I'm always a day closer to coming home, heaven.